Welcome back to Tune for Me News. Here's the latest news from the world of immigration. In order to better manage immigration, it would be a good idea to move beyond centralized management and share responsibility with the regions. This was the comment of the president of the Lombardia region, Roberto Formigoni, during the conference on the last 10 years' activities of the Regional Monitoring Unit on Integration and Multiethnicity organized in Milan. Being able to establish the extent of immigration flows, Formigoni added, would mean that we would be better able to quantify them in relation both to real employment needs and our ability to welcome migrants. The data on immigration in Lombardia shows that on the 1st of July 2009, the number of immigrants, both legal and illegal, coming from countries with strong migratory pressure reached a figure of 1,170,000. Eight hundred and fifty thousand immigrants were hired in Italy between 2004 and 2008, 75 percent of the total. The data has been issued by ISTAT, the National Statistics Institute, which carried out a survey centering on mobility in the employment market. According to the study, in 2008 the population of working age was made up of around 50,800,000 people. As compared to the first three months of 2004, there has been an increase of 3.5 percent, equivalent to around 1,700,000 people, of of whom more than 75% were of foreign nationality. The share of immigrant workers in relation to the total number of people employed has thus more than doubled in the space of the four years considered, rising from 3% to 6.5%. In order to enroll at schools in Trentino, it is necessary to present applications to primary and middle schools by the 27th of February, whereas applications for high schools and vocational training institutes can be presented up to the 26th of March 2010. For all enrollments, if the expiry falls on a Sunday or public holiday, the deadline is extended to the next working day. The 31st of August has instead been established as the deadline for the presentation of applications for enrollment in adult cultural literacy courses, middle school courses, for adults and adult courses at high schools and secondary educational institutes. The Brazilian consulate in Milan has communicated that for exceptional reasons it will not be possible to set up the provisional help desk at the multipurpose hall at Cinformi in Trento. The mobile office was scheduled for Thursday the 11th and Friday the 12th of February. The consulate has underlined that service will be postponed until further notice. In the meantime, the information even planned for Wednesday the 10th of February has also been cancelled. As soon as the new dates have been established for the Brazilian consulate mobile help desk of Trento, Cinformi and will inform the public through its usual communication channels. That's it for now from this week's edition of Chinformi News. Thank you for being with us and enjoy the rest of your day.